Hey guys, welcome back. Well, we're in the game. We're, not, we a, get on this side. we're not on the practice tee, but we're in we, front of front. We're fashion one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We got, uh, and we just want to talk here. Marty has been kind enough to give me a little bit extra time, and he hasn't seen Channel Lock yet. And uh, having been around Marty as long as I have and, and saw the evolution of, of the original DOCF and, and what it was, uh, when I when I found Channel Lock, I felt that it was quite unique uh, to me and to, 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 to the golf uh, swing mechanics um, realm, something quite unique. And, and I just said to Marty off camera here, now the basic premise, and I'll go through the premise, and you can just tell me what do you think in terms of, uh, is this someone else, something that someone else has used or someone else has taught? Um, I believe it's not, and I, and, I, and, and I think Marty will probably concur. Okay, Marty, now what I do in, in, in this golf swing is that I position the golf ball off the trail foot. It's, it's, no, it's, never, it's not centre, it's not forward of centre. The, it's entirely off the trail foot, and it stays on the trail foot. The weight orientation is biased towards entirely and completely the trail axis, in that we basically just stand there like that, the left side or the lead side is unloaded, and I could unzip it and throw it away because it plays no part in my thinking relative to the golf swing. The other thing that's really different, uh, I, th I think, and quite unique, is that, that the club, as, as a process of thinking and actuality of physicality and anatomical movement, is that it goes immediately rearwards, guys. Now, rearwards is a word that's not used in the golf swing. We are backwards and forwards. But this is rearwards. This is a rearwards golf swing and an outwards golf swing. It's not a, a, a backwards and a forwards. It's not sideways. It's rearwards and outwards. It's tangential to the target line. So, so our channel is beside the body. We swing the club beside the body, uh, not in front of the body ever. Um, the club is pushed down in the backswing, the pressure is down, never, never any propensity to, to elevate the club, and the shoulders are cocked shut at uh, address and want to remain shut at impact so that the club is always travelling tangentially to the target line, across the target line, hit with all the weight predominantly back here on the trail axis. It's like a firing away from a of a, from a trail axis um, uh, application of, of, of mass positioning. So here, it's from beso beside the body, uh, rearwards of the, of the body, with closed shoulders, with no intention ever of rotating the golf club ever and finishing with the golf club around the body or the body finishing around there as an intention. Mm -hmm. So what say you, Master? Well, I mean, you've had people tell you that they think that's a derivative of, of what I've talked about. Yeah. Well, it's not. You know, I don't think that there's... I can see where there are aspects of it that look similar to a couple of my drills. For example, the, the 45 drill, um, where you hit it on the trail side of you. Um, what that's designed to do, from my perspective, is get people to understand that they want to hit it on the trail side of them in rotation. What you're advocating is no not, only, yeah, not yeah. only no turn as an intention, but no rotation as no, an intention. No rotation. So, no. you know, I, I like a distinction between turn and rotation, but I certainly advocate free rotation on a, on a line of you. What John's advocating is the club moving on a line and you remaining on your geometry, as yeah. you, you yeah. term it, um, so yeah, it's very, very different, very different to what you and I ever talked about. Um, you know, I think that uh, for somebody to say that that's just purely a derivative or the same thing as what I'm saying is, is rubbish. It's not, it's completely different. Mm -hmm. It's different balance, it's different ball position, it's different alignments, it's different um, intentions of motion. For example, you, you're saying you pressure the club down the yeah. whole way or whatever, it's not the same thing. So that's really all I have to say on it. So the um, so the prosecution rests your honour. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I mean the jury's the jury's come back. And come back with with an affirmative for so the you know, for the defendant. 
Well, the, the, you don't need to defend yourself. No, that's no. It. But I mean, the thing is, I, I just think that there's there's so much. Um, it's come over here in the light, yeah, right? But there's so much stuff that gets said online, right? That um, is done so conclusions drawn, uh, statements made based on incomplete information. Yeah. And so, ability to decipher information, yeah. more to the point. Yeah, well, the thing is, if, I mean, you've spent more time with me talking about this than, than most people, so if anybody knows how much of this is a derivative of what I teach, it would be John anyway. Um, so, you know, for somebody who hasn't spent any time with me at all to say to you that yeah. you're teaching the same thing as me, then they're clearly not understanding either one. So, 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 so buddy, um, I'm... Do you think I'm in court by suggesting to myself and to to guys that I have a unique ultimate that no, is I unique? Yeah. Well, I've never seen anybody talk about it in that way. Yeah. I mean, what you're talking about, about actually having the club swing in, and through intention and actuality mm. with your shoulders closed, swinging deliberately that way. Mm. Um, some people have advocated swinging that way, but not from there. Not from a black back ball no, position. Not from there, no. yeah, yeah. No. yeah. So, you know, no, I think it's unique. I don't think there's anything that um, I don't think there's any. There's, like I said, there's a couple of drills, like the stalk drill, mm. where you have the left left foot more unweighted than, mm. than the right, and maybe that's you know had some played some part in your history of your golf that's led you to this. But mm. this itself is not a derivative of what we talk no, about. No, no, no. So and, and I guess the I, I guess what makes that's it that's the only connection I could possibly see that somebody could make. Well, there. I guess. I guess the thing in my mind that that really delineates it from every other process uh, is the the rear ball position opposite the right foot, opposite the the trail shoulder. Yeah, nobody had the case. No, no, no one's ever been there, have they? Yeah. No. yeah. Okay, guys. So you just heard it from the inventor of uh, of DOCF and northbound. And the, uh, and the inventor of, of Channel Lock. And Marty hasn't seen me hit Channel Lock yet, and no. I think, but I've done a few videos which I'll send you, but, but mate, we'll do another day, because, yeah. you know, you don't hit any balls, but it'd be great for you to come down one day and, and we just, yeah, you know, just shoot the breeze and hit some balls. And um, uh, because I'd I, like to, I I'd can, like to get I your... I unban myself from the range to hit some balls with you. Uh, but, but I'd just like to get your feedback sure. on it and say, well, Jay, so I think, because guys, what have I said about this protocol? It's not a finished protocol. It's still an evolutionary thing. And to get some feedback, and I, and I know that Marty would be, you know, only too happy to help me evolve this to a final protocol and a protocol that has you know, certainly um, the optimum mechanics in it. And you may say, hey, Jay, I see something there. Why don't you do this? And mate, I would just love to get that because I feel I'm feeling certain things uh, happening, um, but whether the degree of them is is what I need to be applying, or whether I have to, you know, make the degrees a little bit different or something, or just apply a little bit else. And I don't think it'd be any skin off your nose to, to help me. Not at all. Yeah. Okay, guys. Mr. DOCF, Mr. Northbound, has uh, good to see you again. Has has affirmed that uh, and confirmed that. DOCF is not... Uh, well, they're, uh, they're very different. Yeah, so good on you, mate. There's no reason for you to need to defend that anymore. Good on you, mate. Thank you, my friend. No